Hey folks, this is Vincent Ida Lee with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to play Constellations. This game supports two to four players. It's for ages eight and up, and the average play time is 30 to 60 minutes. Just to forewarn you guys ahead of time, my uh, son has a friend over, and uh, as most teenage boys do, they get loud. So I will try to keep that to a minimum by editing after the fact, but I can't promise anything. Um, so this game, I've reviewed this already, and I gotta say, I'll, I'll already tell you right now, it's totally worth the $20 on Amazon. Beautiful art, everything is just so colorful. Um, the rule book is like a total of uh, 10 pages, roughly, and the rest of it is all science information. Like, everything you wanted to know about main sequence stars, uh, temperature, radius, mass, luminosity, uh, you know, what is the difference between the types of stars? Like, I love it when rule books go above and beyond like this. And there's even a crossword in the back. So, I, I love it. Anyway, um, how do you play this game? Well, it's sort of a combination of other games. Um, it's like Ticket the Ride in the sense that you've got this display that you can draw cards from, and then you replace them from the deck. It's like Splendor in the sense that you can reserve these constellations here. Uh, you can only reserve one at a time. If you reserve another one when you've already got one, you put one, uh, the one that you have at the bottom of the constellation uh, deck here. But anyway, it's like Splendor in the sense that you can reserve constellations. And your ultimate goal is to uh, collect sets of cards and then turn in those cards to build these constellations over here. For example, in order to build Gemini, I would need to discard two blue, two uh, F, I guess that's peach, white, whatever, uh, two yellow G stars, and two red M stars. Well, if I do that, I would get 12 points. Uh, if I manage to link it to, say, Lynx or Ariga, I'm going to be butchering some of these names. Um, if I manage to uh, put them adjacent to those things, I get two points per. Uh, I also get points for every gem that I link. So. If, I don't know if you guys can see it or not, uh, but there's gems along the outside of these. Now you can rotate this any way you want to. So I might want to do, I could do something like this. There's yellow, yellow there. Um, and I would get one point for each matching gem. If you do put a constellation down and nothing matches, then you lose a point. So you want to try and match wherever possible. So you get points, one point per gem that you match, you get points just a base total here, and then an extra two points for every constellation name that you link here. Um, and that's basically what you're doing in this game. You're going to take one of three actions on your turn. You're going to take a card from either the deck or the display. Um, another thing you can do is reserve a card, and the other thing you can do is turn in cards to build one of your constellations. And that's it. And we're going to keep doing this until this constellation deck runs out, and whoever has the most points wins. There's point tokens on the left. All right, so I'll let you go first. You can go first. No, it's okay. You can go. All right, fine. <laughs> Twist my arm, why don't you? Okay, these are the cards I have. So I need to look at this and determine, okay, what what, what do I have a good chance of building right now? So um, this could go toward one of those two constellations there because that color matches these two down here. Um, so I may want to look at one of those. Uh, there's that I need for Canis Major. Um, don't need that for Canis Major. I don't need this for Canis Major. I do need this, but you can overbuild. Like, if you only need one K-Star and you have a two K-Star in your hand, you can overbuild, um, but there is an advanced, there's a number of advanced uh, rule sets in the manual that are optional, and one of those is you have to have an exact, you have to have the exact change, if you will. Uh, you, you know, you can't overpay. Or if you overpay, you lose points, something like that. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna actually going to take one from the array, I think. And I'm going to take... Um, I'm going to take this B star. And there is no hand limit. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Cool. Now it's your turn. Okay, I will take the... A star. Okay. I will take a B star. Ooh, two A stars. I will take the two you A stars. You will take the two A stars, absolutely. Um, I'm actually going to take the K. I don't want to overpay if I go after the one I want. Um, or I can put that toward Andromeda here, mm -hmm. which needs three. Mm -hmm. 
I'm telling the folks at home. Does the new one. Yes, thank you. <laughs> okay. Um, very simple game. It is. But it's very colorful. I like it. Can you go after, like, you pick up, or is that... Or no, is that it's one of your actions, so, like, if you're... if you Once you take, you're done. I see. Okay, I will take it off card. <laughs> okay, I have a feeling you're going to build something next turn. Um, mm -hmm. I will take the A star, because I don't have one of those. I'm telling Ida Lee because <laughs> I'm an idiot. Um, need one of those. So you said overbuilding is a bad idea? Well, you, you can. It's fine. In, in the basic game, you can do it. It's not going to hurt you. In the basic game? Yeah, that's what we're playing. That's what we're playing. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, I would like to build something. Okay, go for it. I would like to build this. Okay, so you need um, six of the B stars, one A star, one F star, and one K star. And then you can rotate it any way you want to. To Okay, so you got six B stars there, one F, one. Okay, so you got everything. You overpaid the K, but that's fine. I did. That's fine. So these go into a discard pile. Okay. And I'm going to put these over here. So, yeah, figure out how you want to rotate that. Um, I want to, like, curve it. <laughs> no, it has to go flat. Nice try, though. Um, you get a bonus if it's next to Canis Minor and Ar Aridinus. Sure. How, how do I know this one's mine? Do we, we and it doesn't matter. You're gonna, you're gonna get tokens once you put that down. Oh, okay. So, okay, so yeah, that's, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. You can, you can rotate it any which way you want. And, and let me see how many base points you get first oh. before, I, uh, it's seven. So you get seven base points, plus you get one, two. So that's nine points that you get. Cool. So here's a five, and here's, Four ones. Okay, so you got nine Can points. Can I redeem these to get, you know, more cards mm, or something? That would be a cool advanced <laughs> variant. That would be cool. All right, um, so a new one gets drawn. Uh, this is Cancer. I need uh, two yellow and one K for this one. That's only three points, though. Uh, bonus if it's next to Leo Minor and Gemini. Okay, I don't... Gemini is actually one of them here. So these two would go well together. Mm -hmm. Um... Oh, can I can I always like check or no? Check what? I don't know. Like, you you can't can you can, what you can't rescore. No, you... but can I like see what what it said in the underneath it? For what reason? I don't know to see if I had another bonus like that. Uh, you can't earn any more bonuses after you put it down. This is Canis Minor and Aridinus, but, uh, but it doesn't. So if an originus comes here, it, it doesn't add. It, it might actually say it like I think like I think the originus card has Canis Major on it. Oh. It may. I'm not sure. Oh, oh I see. by the way, folks, uh, some of them aren't being used um, in the two-player game. You're gonna well in any player game, you're gonna take out some of these. Oh. Uh, so not all of the constellations are in the game. Okay. Um, there's a chart in the manual in case you're curious. Okay, so my turn. Mm -hmm. um, well, now that I don't need any more B-stars, because that's, yeah. Um, Cancer goes next to Leo Minor and Gemini. Whereas, okay, I'm going to take the M-star over here. All right, the one star, or yes, the, yeah, the one star. That is a uh, wild, yeah, <laughs> go for it. All right, um... I will take the yellow two B stars again. And again, you can also take from the deck if you don't want to take from oh, the array. Yeah, that's right. I'm just good. saying, you, you don't, you know, whatever. Can I build something? Yeah, if you have the stuff for can it. Can I build this? Yes, absolutely. So you're going to build, so two yellow, one K. Yeah. Or two G, one, one K. So where are you going to put that? I don't know. Can I flip it over first and then put it? Oh well, yeah, whatever. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can I do this? Even though this doesn't match. That's that's fine. Yeah, and these yeah. So you've so let me see here. That's that the base is it, next to Leo Minor and Gemini, and the base is three points. So it's three points plus one, two, three. So that's six. You okay. get six points for that. But right? I, I didn't get that bonus right because it's not next to a Gemini or correct. The other one. Not yeah. So yeah, you still get the bonuses for the gems, but no bonuses yeah. for the the adjacent constellation I bonus. See. So you get six cool. six points for that. Okay, good job. And we're gonna flip another one over. This is Sagittarius. 
Uh, lots of stuff here. It gets a bonus for Capricornus and Ophicus. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, let's take a look. I need to start earning some points here. Mm -hmm. uh, got that. Got that. I need another one of these, and I got. Okay. I'm gonna draw from the deck. And build something. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, you've got like, I don't know. You sure you didn't take cards somehow when I wasn't looking? Okay. It's amazing. Okay. Two G stars. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, another rule I forgot to tell you. Um, if you don't have what you need, uh, let's say you, you had everything for a card except for one. You can reserve. Oh no. You can turn in three cards of another type to in place of the one that you want. So let's say you needed an A. You could turn in three G oh, stars or three F stars, something like that. So three for one. That's the ratio of three to one. Three to one, yes. Okay. If yeah. That's if you don't have so it's a waste, but mm -hmm. So it but it it applies to any single symbol? For any, like, A, B, G, F, yes. M, whatever? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so if I needed an M for this, if I had everything except for the M, I could turn in, say, three more A's. Okay, so it doesn't matter what symbol as long as you have the amount of cards. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see. All right, oh, crap. Well, Andromeda gets a bonus for Perseus and Pisces. Or Persis. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Perseus. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not very good at pronouncing these constellations. All right, well, anyway, um, I've got what I need for that. I can't uh, even see it. <laughs> well, if you need me to pick some up for you, I can, I'm just gonna draw from the deck. All right, there's another one of these, which I didn't need. Okay, your turn. Look at you go. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna grab that. Mm -hmm. I could use it. Two K stars. Man! <laughs> Uh, I'm actually going to need that. Mm -hmm. I know which one you're going for. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> um, I need a particular one, but I don't know. Oh, yeah, we have to redraw. I'll take that. Ooh. That's, yeah, I needed that bad. All right. There's an F star. I'm going to build. Of course you will. <laughs> what are you going to build? I'm actually going to build a Gemini. Of course you are. <laughs> okay, so it what gets a it? it gets a bonus when next to Lynx and Origa. Okay, and it, I'm gonna trade. Can I trade four for one? Or does yes, it have you to can. You can one? do. Yeah, it could be more than three. I yeah, three or more. So you're gonna. So you you have the two A's that you need. Yep. Uh, you've got the G's that you need. You got the M's you need. And the F. The F, but okay. So you need if you're gonna for one F. Oh, for six. I need you you would six. you would need six. Yeah, never star, Six stars of another well, type. Well, then in that case, I'll take the F. <laughs> uh, okay, gotcha. Um, Darn, I forgot. That's okay. That's good math on your part. No, you're fine. Capricornus. So Cancer, Taurus, and Canis Major are out right now, mm -hmm. and none of those have a bonus. So. I might as well go for points. Um, all right, so I'm gonna build Gemini myself. Ah! I've got okay. two. I've got two K stars. Oh, I don't need the K for that. I need two M, which I have. Mm -hmm. I've got the two yellow that I need for that. Mm -hmm. I've got the two F stars, and I've got uh, two A stars. Nice. So exact. That's fine. Goes discard pile, and we're gonna put Gemini somewhere. Mm -hmm. uh, I get 12 points as a base, so we'll just take 12, and I get a bonus if it's next to Lynx and Origa, which I, it's not on the board, so I just need to match stuff. Um, ooh. This one kind of stinks. Mm -hmm. Trying to match as much as possible. What about over here? Nope. You can match up one purple. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the matching on this is kind of bad. Um, actually, what about over here? Ooh. No. Crap. Um, wow, this was a terrible one to build, apparently. How come 
What if you flip it? What happens if you flip it? No, you can't flip. Okay, this is as good as I'm going to get. Oh, okay. Um, so I got my base points. Um, I got one gem for this one and one gem for that one. So I get two more points. Cool. And that was Gemini. Okay, so we're going to draw Lupus. I think that's one of my favorites. I just love the wolf. Mm -hmm. Six B stars, one G star. Gets an adjacency to Scorpius and Centaurus. Whoa. And it's worth four points. And it is your turn. Now this is where strategy is coming into play. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Those gems and the adjacency bonuses. Mm-hmm. could overpay. You could. And in case you folks are curious, if you want to pause the video right now, here's a look at all the advanced rules that are in the rule book. I'm not going to read them off to you because we're in the middle of something, but mm -hmm. pause the video. You can read them at your leisure if you so wish to. That will give you an idea of what you're getting into. There's also, if you want to pause here, solo and team play rules. So there is a solo variant. Pretty cool stuff. to build. Okay. Can I build this? Andromeda. I love that name. Mm -hmm. So you need 3K, 1M, 1A, 1B. Alright, so I got the 1A on this 2 star. Okay. I got the, two, the 1B on this okay. 2 star. I got an F. I got 2G. I got 2K and I have 1M. Whoa. But if I took, if I took Okay, I don't know if we can do this, but if I good took... Good question. You mean the extras from that? Yeah. Um, can you do that? That is a good question. I don't know. Um, let's see. Because I did the math and it would get rid of all my cards. <laughs> okay. A player may substitute three or more stars of one type in the place of a different type. So you would need to have exactly three uh, B. Okay. So you can't use extras from other... I see. Yeah. That would have been so. cool though. Yeah. <laughs> So you would need three B. Oh man! Or, All right. Well, for, in this case, like say three F stars in place of the A. I see. I see. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um. But yeah, you were trying to use the extras from the two stars to do that. I was. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Okay. So the bonuses here: are Scorpius, Centaurus. None of them. Mm -hmm. Um. Percy's. Pisces, Capricornus, okay, again, no adjacency bonuses here. Mm -hmm. So basically, I'm looking for the gems. Um, if I were to match any right now, what would, what would, be, what would be ideal here? Um, it's hard to visualize that in my head. Because this one, like, I'm, okay. Um, all right, I'm going to go with, because we've got a lot of, okay. Okay, so let's go with the B star. There's some more A stars for everybody. Mm hmm. <laughs> mm hmm. This is tough. One, one G, I need an F, I need two. Okay, so yeah. Okay. Going for the two A stars. Okay. Um, uh, I need... I'm going to draw from the deck. Not what I needed. I mean, I could now go for something else if I wanted to. Okay. I'm going to build this one. Andromeda. Okay, so one if B. If I can. <laughs> okay, one B, one A, three K, one M. So, I got the A. Okay, so you got the 1A, okay? I got the M. You got the 1M that you need, yep. I got the B. You got the B, so you need 3K. Can I trade in 3B for um, another K? Yeah. Um, okay, so you have 2K. Mm -hmm. I used 1K, right. so can I do the, I, the rest of it? Well, yes, we'll house can rule. Can I do, is it, is yeah, it I not think, I, I don't know, but we'll house rule it, because that, that makes sense. It does make sense. You're using one B, and you're going to use three stars of another type. Is there more than a two? 
Hmm? Is there more? Is there cards? Are there? Cards no, there's no more than the two. Oh, okay. So this is that's good. Okay, I would we'll allow that. No, that makes sense. I mean, I don't know how. No, no, me work. neither. The rules say three of the same type. That that to me that makes sense. So yeah, where do you want to put this? You get seven points. Um, so here's one, two. Okay, I'm actually gonna take some of these ones back mm -hmm. and give you a five. Thank you. Actually, I'm gonna. I'm going to give you a 10 and take a 5. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now you got to figure out where to rotate it, where to put it. Yeah. I'm going to put it right uh, here and connect 3. Okay. So you got one, two, three. Awesome. Now what was, okay, I don't think there oh, was an adjacency. No, you're fine. There was no adjacency bonus for that. So it's seven points, which I already gave you. Go ahead and flip it back and put it where you had it. Um, yeah, and that's one, two, three. So you get three more points. Mm -hmm. So how many ones do you have over there? What two. All right, can you give me your two and I'll give you a five. There you go. Oh, there's fireworks. That's fireworks? That's fireworks. I don't know why. It's scary. <laughs> it's not the 4th of July, but whatever. Uh, so I just drew Norma from the deck. It's five points. It has an adjacency to Telescopium and Lupus, which Lupus is here. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Okay. Um, again, I need to... Uh, I'd like to draw again. I'm getting an M. I'm hoarding cards. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, this is like Ticket to Ride all over again. I'll grab this. Two stars. Awesome. Um, I mean, I may have to build just to stay in the game, but... I've got... Okay. Uh, I could do that. Okay. Let's do... Well, see, no, because if I do that and she builds that, then she gets that bonus, and I don't. So I'm, I'd have to make sure I can build that one right away, but I don't think I can based on my cards. I mean, I might be able to, actually. Um, one, two, three, see, I, all right, I'm going to go ahead and grab another G-Star. How many cards do you have? Five. Five? <laughs> you're, you're only gonna, five. Only five. Okay. That's terrible. Um, let's see if I can do this two turns in a row. Six and one. And then I would need... Okay, no. I need one more G-Star. And then... Two A, which I have here. Yeah, okay. The one I really want. I'm going to build this one. <laughs> You're going to build Norma. Wow, with five. Co That's awesome. Okay. You get. Okay, so two. look at you. Okay, exact. So you get five base. Uh, Telescopium and Lupus. No. Is lupus. You're about to build that one. <laughs> I was going to build that and then this. So, okay. So where are you going to put Norma? I'm going to put her. Where the sun won't shine. Yeah. Really. Yeah. <laughs> there is no sun here. <laughs> Um, well, technically, every star is a sun. Yeah, that's true. See? There, so there are plenty of stars. They're constellations. Ooh. Smart. Yeah, Smarty makes yeah. smart. Smarty makes, yes. <laughs> I can't do this, huh? <laughs> no, it has to be flat. Hmm, there you go. There's at least three there. Hold on, I'm calculating. You're calculating. Well, the most you're going to get is four, based on the current layout. Yeah. So... I'm trying to also picture this one, too, because I'm actually uh, points. <laughs> I see. I'm a, I'm a terrible human being. No, that's strategy. I guess I'll do this to prevent you from okay. getting stuff. So that's three, I believe. Yeah, three. One, two, three. 
Good job. Thank you. Next one is Orion. Orion is 13 points, gets a bonus to Canis Major and Taurus. Uh, Taurus is out, actually. And mm -hmm. Canis, uh, that's Canis Imp Major. So it's either this one or this one. So it could go next to either one and get some points. Uh, mm -hmm. So uh, Orion is definitely looking pretty nice right now. Mm -hmm. Needs two O-Stars, though. Oh my gosh, we wow. haven't seen any of those. No. Crazy. Um, crazy. So... How do I do this? Do I keep drawing in the hopes of getting more O stars? I wonder how many O stars are in the deck. I wonder if it tells me. And I'll tell you if I find out. But mm -hmm. um, looking at the rule book, I don't see. It just says 72 star cards. It doesn't say how many of each. Oh wait, there's um, four O stars. And uh, one, two O star. So there's five O's in the deck. Wow. <laughs> For a total of six. A lot. <laughs> no. So the chances of getting Orion, um, I mean, we could, I think, substitute three cards for the O, like to do that. So, but we'd have to disc I'd have to discard a lot of cards to do that. Mm -hmm. But I might be able to. Let's see if I have the ability to do this. All right. So this would be. Let's just see. Okay. So this is. Whoops. <laughs> Dropping cards everywhere. Okay, so this is what I need for that. Um, I have... Oh, no! Stupid. All right. Um, I could probably build it with my two cards. Yes, you could. <laughs> I, I wouldn't put it past you. Um, terrible. I'm going to do... I'm going to take the two A stars here. If I'm going to start substituting, I'm going to need a lot of stars. K star. Uh, my turn. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. I keep thinking that when you pull from the deck, you already win. <laughs> no, I, I was replacing, but okay, that's sorry. fine. That's fine. Um, I will need a K-Star. Dang. <laughs> Two B-Stars. Um, yeah. Um, actually, no, what? Four, and then one. And then one, two. All right, let's change of plans. Mm -hmm. Two. Build a lupus, aren't you? Uh, no. Oh. Two. Uh, uh, uh. Build all three of them, huh? <laughs> okay, got that. Yeah, all three. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Two. Oh, I don't have. I don't have the one that I need. I could. I could discard to get it, but I don't know. I don't think I want to do that yet. All right, I'm just going to draw from the deck. All right, got what I needed. You're going to pick up that. It's a B star. Aha! Okay. Lucky O. <laughs> I might actually go for that. We'll see. I still need a certain card type. Like, I, I need... <sighs> Taking the B star. Ah, okay. Aha! Aha! <laughs> Taking the B star! Okay, let's see if I got this. Alright, um, 1 0. I've got the F that I need. I've got 2, 3, 4. Right, I'm going to put it up here so the camera can see it. Mm -hmm. I got the F star. I got five B stars. Is that an O star? That's an O star. Oh, so those are wild cards and, and it counts as yes. oh my mm -hmm. goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I need uh, five B, one F. I need an M, which I have. Nice. Um, and I need another O star. You need another five, right? Another B star. Mm hmm. I have, oh, that four? Yeah. Oh, my bad. Uh, here's one more. And you need another O star. I need a no star. So I'm going to discard three cards to do that. Mm -hmm. And what do I have the most of? Um, what can I afford to get rid of? Uh, okay, I've got a lot of these, actually. So I might do... Um, I want to get rid of three A stars in place of one O star. Nice. 
And I will take Orion and build that in a minute. That's a lot of points. Yeah. You just caught up to me. <laughs> no, I don't know about that. Um, okay, so first I have to figure out how this is going to go. It needs to be next to Taurus or Can Canis Major for that bonus. Um, actually, this would work, I think, unless, no. Okay, yeah. So I think this is the right way to go about it. That's one, two, three there. That's so, um, okay, so I get 13 points for the base. So that would be 10, one, two, three. Darn, I should have went over here. And uh, I get two points if it's next to Canis Major, which I have two, okay. So I'm going to take a five and put back three. Mm -hmm. All right, and I also get one, two, three points for the gem. So I'm going to turn in. I can't. Can I can I trade for twenty five? Yeah. So I took three, and now I'm going to take a five and put back five. I'm just going to. Yeah, and I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to turn in 25 for a 25. And you have a 25 for a 25. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Less tokens that way. Yeah. Okay. All right, so new one comes out. It is Pisces. Uh, bonus for Aries and Cetus. Seven points. Aww. Okay. And it is uh, your turn. All right, so I can go for that, go for that, go for, for that, don't need enough, but go for that, I need the two <laughs> Okay, cool. I will take that. Oh Didn't have to think about that one. I know. Lucky. Oof, I will take from the deck. Mm -hmm. It is that. What could possibly be going on this weekend that there's fireworks? Taken. Oh, wait. Hmm? Did you go? I went. Mm -hmm. There's an M star. Um, I need a particular card. Oh, now I get that. Of course I do. No, take your time. Um, Just asking. For a friend. <laughs> asking for a friend, yeah. The folks at home want to know. Yeah. Um. Oh, man. There's one I want to get. I could turn those in to get one that I need. Can I take from the deck? Absolutely. All right, let's see if I have what I need for this. Um. I hate overpaying, but this would be, okay, we have that, we have this, two. actually, let's just go down the line, I'm going to forget what I put down, okay, I've got the, got this one, I need four there, I need one here, I need one here, I need... So you can build more than one in one turn? No. Oh. Two there, and one, two. My goodness. Or I could keep this and do these. Are you building another solar system? Yes, I'm building an entire <laughs> galaxy. Jeez. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep this one in case I need it for later. All right, so just, just to show you what I did, um, I have an M star. Yeah. I've got 4K. I've got the G, the yellow. I've got two F stars, which I'm overpaying on. Mm -hmm. uh, 2A. Um, I've got one B. And then I'm turning in three yellow as the other B. Okay. So I'm going to put Sagittarius down somewhere. 
I'm going to go through most of my cards. Um, okay, so... Crap. Of course. Uh, you're not going to be nice to me, are you? Yellow. I could put two yellow there. I could do yellow here. Unfortunately, there's no blue on the outside. Blue. No, that's opposite. I might just do, well, see, that would set you up pretty good for the next one. I don't want to do that. Oh, crap. All right, I'm just going to put Sagittarius over here for two points. Right, so I get a base of 12 points. Uh, it's next, not next to Gemini, or it, it's not next to Capricornus or uh, Ophicus. Mm -hmm. So it was, what was it, 12? Yeah, 12 plus 2 more is 14. Wow. So I'm going to turn in a 1 and take 15. Nice. All right, and it is your turn. Now I'm going to replace uh, Canis Minor. This came out. Uh, it's three points, 1B, one 1F. One points next to Leo and Orion. Wow. Fireworks. Oh yeah, God. I think that's the finale. They're so loud. And Leo and Orion? Yeah, Leo and Orion. Which, Orion should be out. Here it is. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't think Leo's out. Mm-mm. All right. All what right. is that one? Scorpion, Scorpius and Centaurus? Yes. Scorpius and Centaurus, I don't believe, are out. Then which was that one? Pisces, uh, Aries, and Cetus. I don't sure. think they're out either. Okay. Oh, this is getting tough. <laughs> mm-hmm. Um... Hmm. Tough. Yeah, it is. Okay. Okay. Oh, crap. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. That sounds like... Machine guns? Yeah. Yeah. Or if someone, after they ate it. Burrito. Yeah, after they go to Taco Bell. It's... <laughs> oh my gosh. And the muffled sound is because they're in a car, like driving home. Oh my gosh. What you don't hear is the sound of glass breaking. <laughs> <laughs> As the implosion from the inside out. I'm going to take an A. All right. Um, I'm going to take from the deck, actually. What happens when the deck runs out? We discard, or we Shuffle. use the discard pile, and it becomes the new deck. Cool. Mm. Sorry. No, it's okay. Um, you know what? I will build the Canis Miner. Miner? Okay. Because why not? One B, one F. You got it. Okay. Good job. Yeah. It's three points, so I'll give you three right now. Ooh. You got it. And then I'm going to connect it to Orion. Okay, which gives you another two points. Yeah. And now I just got to figure out how the heck to connect this. Mm. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap. One, two, Whoa. three, four? Uh, one, two, three. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four. Yep. Cool. So can you give me a one? I'll give you a five. Sure. I thought that wasn't gonna work for a second. No, you got it. Good job. That was a good, good one. Mm -hmm. Um. So the new one coming out is Virgo. Oh, my mom's. Is it really? Yeah. Uh, Boots and Leo cool. are the adjacency bonuses. I don't think either of them are out. Okay, so that's worth ten points. Um, let's see. I guess I should just need to continue getting cards at this point. All right, so I need to restock. Um, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take a uh, a. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. or kabam <laughs> get it kabam oh my gosh <laughs> oh my why can't you put why can't you put hold on hold on back them no hold on backma i'm backman Okay. <laughs> Almost. I'm Bakma. I'm Bakma. Yeah, 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 sure. All right, I'm going to build Bathgum, the oh, Virgo. Oh, Ral, wow, that was okay. So you're going to build the Virgo. Yeah. 1B. So 1B. 2A. 2A. Uh huh. 2F. 1G. Okay, 1G. 1M. 1M. And. Oh, 2F. 2F. Well, you can discard other cards if you want. No, I can't. Okay. Oh, you can't build it? Okay. So it's still my turn, right? It is still your turn. Chavi, you know what you mean? Mm. You probably have it too. I will take the two B stars, actually. I'm gonna build it. <laughs> of course you will. Okay, so that K helped me out. <laughs> All right, so let's try this again. One B. One B. Two A. Two A. One G. One G. One M. One M. Two F. And you need two F. 6K for 2F. 6K for 2F. Okay. Wow. All right then. That's so sad. That's good. So you what get, a waste. Well, here's 10 points for the base. Adjacency, Boots, and Leo. Nothing. Which So now you just get points for the gems. Yeah. Oh, this is going to hurt my heart. Mm-hmm. theme song. You got a lot of ones, so how about a five and you give me two back? Sure. Two ones? Yep. Okay. And, and I can trade want... all these ones for a five. Okay. Actually, here, take a 25. You can do 15, yeah, 15, 25. There you go. Okay. So now you got 55 there. Good job. Whoa. The new one coming out is Aries. You have 51. I have 55 on my group. Okay, sorry. You've got 55. I don't have 51. Yeah, you have 51. Oh, do I? Mm -hmm. No, because this is only 20. I've only got 20 here. Oh. I can't. I've got that. 25, 35, 45, 46 points. Ah, still, you're going to be. No. Right. <laughs> um, who did I just draw? Aries, Taurus, and Andromeda. Oh, my K's. <laughs> All your K's. My K's are gone. Um, so. Um, where's Tars? There, okay. And Andromeda is there. Oh, Ooh. good job. Okay, well, um, you probably could build that. So I'm going to try and do it before you do. So I'm going to do an A. I've got two B stars, which I'm overpaying on, and a K. So I'm going to build Aries. I get three for the base, and I'm going to put it up here next to Andromeda and Taurus for two points each. So I'm going to take a five and give one and change. Mm -hmm. And I got. And you have to put it back after you place it. What do you mean put it back? Because because it says back. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, get out of my face. <laughs> get out of my house. Get out of here. You're moving out. You're done. Oh, that actually works out pretty well. Three so I got points. one, two, three. Okay, so that's three wow. points. That's a lot of points. So you added like the bonus and everything. Too. Yeah, I got that too. So I'm going to give wow. myself a five for these ones. And I'm going to turn in 25 for a 25 token. Wow, now you have 50. You're like ahead. 
ahead of me now. I told you. No. I told you. I've got 56. I know, I have 55. I'm off by one point. <laughs> Big deal. Leo. You were down by like 10. It's Miss Cleo. Miss Cleo. <laughs> Miss Leo. Okay. <laughs> Call me now for your free reading. <laughs> Where's the moon card? Where's the moon card? <laughs> All these nosy people. <laughs> I whoop you. <laughs> Is there a man in your life? <laughs> <laughs> Candice made. Where's the minor card? Yeah. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, here it is. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Leo. <laughs> Miss Cleo. We gotta end. We gotta end that. Yeah, that's terrible. All right, Leo. Ursa, Major, and Cancer. Which I don't think either of them are out. No. Okay, it's your turn. Mm -hmm. All right. Huh. Oh yeah, he did daddy. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is so amazing. Oh, Leo. It's Leo. I'm Leo. <laughs> All right. Um <laughs> She's so fake. She I can't wait. It's my turn. Oh, sorry. I was like, go. Stop talking. Stop talking. Okay. Jeez, Leo. Yeah, Leo. I'm Leo. <laughs> Two O stars. Yes, Dang. thank you. I got to start picking up on the deck. <laughs> Two Fs. Two Fs. Another O star. I'll take it. Right, I'm going to shuffle. Yeah. Wait, was it your turn or my turn? It is your turn. Okay. I believe. Sorry. <laughs> okay, now it's your turn. Okay. All right. love to play like a modified version where neither player sees the board at all. How would that work? <laughs> I don't know. And have like um, a so like a mediator do the connecting mm, or something. Yeah. But he has to do like the most, you know? Yep. All yours. I'm going. I'm going. Yeah, this is, this is tough. It is tough. Tougher than a bag of nails. All right. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know what that meant. Okay. Oh, None of those are out, right? For Which one? Bonuses, all of them. Um, Ursa Major and Cancer. They are. Well, I'm I'm reading them. I don't oh, see oh, them. Oh. Uh, Aries and Cetus. I don't see, and then, well, actually, Aries is up there. And then Scorpius and Centaurus, oh, okay. which I don't see. I'm just trying to give them something to look at. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to build uh, Pisces. Two F, two G, and the one O, the O stars for the A. Darn, I should have taken that. <laughs> um, because I thought you were going to build next turn, so I didn't want to let you get in it. That's good. Um, I guess we'll go with this. Nice. So, uh, I mean, I'm sorry. Let me see what the base. The base is seven points, plus two for being next to Aries. 
and then um, so 7 plus 2 is 9 plus, uh, so it's 10, 11, 12 so I get 12 points mm -hmm. take 12 New one comes out, Aquarius, <laughs> B-A-G-K-M, Pisces, Astronomus, Astronus, and Volpeculia. Wow, well, three of them. Hmm? No, two. I just, oh, oh, okay. Pisces, Astronus is one. Oh. And then Volpeculia is two. The pronunciations are spot on. Yeah, they are. If you look it up in the dictionary, that's, that's, yeah. <laughs> They're fine. They're all fine. When the moon is in the summer sky, and Jupiter mm -hmm. Sorry. <laughs> Aquarium! Ugh. 6B, 1G. Okay, yes. In, uh, oh gosh. See, it's tough. Mm -hmm. Um, let's go with a blind draw. Not very helpful. Mm. You got this. I don't like that rule of, of uh, that three to one ratio anymore. You don't? <laughs> I don't like it. I wish we got rid of that. <laughs> Darn. It just makes it so much harder. Yeah, you're fine. I know, I know. Oh, We're down to three. three. Game's almost over. Yeah, all right, all right. Well, in that case, I'm just gonna build the Leo. Leo. It's Leo. It's Leo. Uh, five. A. Two, three, two, three, four. Um, so one more A. Five. Oh, okay. So you're gonna discard. Yeah. Three B for, for one A. Five. Okay. So you still need a B. One B. One B. Okay. And then you need an F, a G, and a K. <laughs> this is such a waste. F, G. Whoa! Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, you're overpaying. That's okay. Mid but time. you get ten points for that plus whatever else. So 10 points. Plus the two that connects to cancer. Is it? Oh, yeah. I didn't see that. Good job. Yeah. So you get two more. I try to be sneaky about it and stay quiet. <laughs> I didn't see that one. I didn't. OK, so yeah, so you get two more, and then you, whatever you get for the gems. Um, no. None of those match. Oh, that's so sad. That's, that's all disheartening. the yellow and red, they're all on the wrong side. That's disheartening. Oh. Uh, there's two. That's one, two. Oh, that's so sad. One, two. Yeah. All right, hold on. Wait, let me see if I can do better. You're not going to do better. I can do better. Wait, wait. I can do so oh much my better. gosh. Oh, wait, I can do better. <laughs> <laughs> one. Hold on, wait. <laughs> one. <laughs> no, Zero. Just, no. <laughs> Zero. That's two is the most you're going to get. Again, zero. Sorry. One and two. Two. Oh, gosh. <laughs> two. Pick one! Fine, fine. <laughs> Darn, man. All right, Pegasus. It's where Atlantis is. Pegasus Galaxy. Anyway, um, Aquarius and, uh, Aquarius and Vol Volipaculia. All right, so... 12 points for that. This is a tight game. It is. And I'm just throwing it away. <laughs> no, you, you're you you're winning. I'm No, I'm throwing it away because I keep throwing all my cards out. No, you got it. You're you're hoarding. I think that's the strategy, the hoarding, mm. the hoarding strategy. I'm going to take the F star. Seems to be fairly rare. Sure. I'll take the two Bs. Uh, of course you will. <laughs> I'm going to take the A star. I'll take the two bees. Wow. Taking the bees. Mm -hmm. 
Um, believe me. I will believe you. <sighs> All right. I need. <laughs> I have to draw from the deck. Oh, perfect. All right, so I got that. I've got that, and then that, and then I need. Huh? Uh huh. I need. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Good. All right. My turn. Yes. I'll draw from the deck. Draw from the deck. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm gonna take the M star. I'll take the B, sir. Taking the B. I know which one you're going after. You have Lupus. Already... Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. I could just be hoarding again. You could be. Um, I, re I don't really want to spend these, because that might come in handy for later, but... Um, I don't think she's got enough to take the one that I'm going after. <laughs> I mean, I can reserve, too. I, that's, not some, that's not something that we haven't done yet, this game, is reserve. Oh, really? None of us reserved. Remember I told you at the beginning we can reserve? Perfect. Awesome. Okay, we'll take. Totally that. forgot. What happens if you reserve? What's it just ends your turn. Uh, so you can reserve every single one. No, you can only reserve one. <laughs> if, if you... uh, I would reserve Gemini because that's my side. Oh, is it really? <laughs> yeah. Mine's Taurus. It is. Mm -hmm. May. That's, that's so weird. Our, our birthdays are in the same month, and yeah, it's two. Sorry, I'm no, you're checking fine. the battery. <laughs> yeah, there's uh, about twenty minutes. So right. I want to finish this. Is it your up. turn? I already drew from the deck. You did. Mm -hmm. oh. Um. Sorry. <laughs> I'll draft from the thing. Okay. Um. Three B. One A. One F. Two G. One K. Wow. Two M. I still have wow. these left over. All right. Okay, <laughs> so Pegasus. I get 12 points for that. And it has an adjacency to Aquarius. And I know Aquarius was put down somewhere. Um, it's right here. Oh! <laughs> my bad. Well, that's fine. I still got 12 points. That's good. Um, all right, so where am I putting this? I can get three up there. Which I think is going to be my best bet. Um, okay, so I get one, two, three. So three more points. So I'm going to turn in two and pick a five. And I'm going to turn in 25 for a 25 token. Nice, you have more 25 tokens. I'm going to turn in two 25s for 50. <gasps> Can I do that too? Yes. You want a 50? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Uh-huh. Cool. And Leo Minor. Next to Leo and Lynx are the two adjacencies. Um, and actually I could just, yeah, that works. And I should warn you that once this is re yeah. once one of these is gone and this replaces, that's it. Game over. I'm taking that. I figured <laughs> I was going to. Um, okay. I heard you say it, and that's the only reason. <laughs> one. Okay, so you got it. Uh, you get two points for that. Plus, plus uh, is there a Leo one. or a Lynx? Leo. Oh, good. Okay, so another two. Mm -hmm. And where are you gonna put it? I'll put it somewhere. Each player, including the player who triggered the game end, may take one last turn. Okay, oh, so cool. there's still one more to go after this. Okay. We take one final turn. Three points. Three points. Mm -hmm. So actually give me two. And there's your three. Two. Yep. Cool. All right, so we each take one final can I, turn. Can I get a fi uh, five? A five? Yeah. Yeah. Can I get a ten? Yes, you can get a 10. Can I get a 25? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'm like, you know. <laughs> my math is math. a bit rusty. Okay. My math is a bit rusty. 
All right, well, there's nothing I can do. Like, one final turn, like, I can take, but... You've got two cards in your hand. There's no way I, either one of us can take anything in play. So I'm just going to call it now. I mean, I take a turn, I'm going to draw something, you're going to draw something, that's it. So I, I can't play anything. I'm going to build. With two cards? Are you <laughs> kidding me? Okay, so game over. Well, you know, with our cards combined, we could have shared lupus, probably. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> I've got 75, 80, 83. Wow, I have 76. 50, 25. That's good. 50, 75, 80, 83. Almost. That was close. Wow. I built a lot and you just hoarded. You took like the big the big ones. I took a lot of the little stuff. It was ones. it was tough. Like it, it all came down to the adjacency and the gems, really. Mm -hmm. So, all right. Well, what did you think of this? That was really fun. You would like this? You play it again? Yeah, I would. Yeah. I'm not big into constellations, but. Oh, you're breaking my heart. I know. Sorry. <sighs> oh well. I, as I said at the beginning of this video, I highly recommend it. It's mm -hmm. loads of fun. Um, very simple, good family-friendly game. Yeah. Again, all the information in the back of the manual is awesome. I I, I really like that. Cards very colorful. <laughs> Um, advanced rules that you can observe. There's solo, team variants. So, 20 bucks on Amazon. If I remember, I'll put a link in the below description for you. Alright, this is Vincent Ida Lee. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you guys next time. Take Bye. care. Bye, guys.